You may continue working on the current project or open the 4pavilion.pln archicad file from the training project folder. We'll add basic wall dimensions to the project on the floor plan. Choose the dimension tool from the toolbox. Select DIM 2.5 from the Favorites palette. Set the geometry method to XY only in the info box. Click on the upper left corner of the vertical wall, then the bottom right corner of the other vertical wall. You can see two reference points. In order to finish the dimensioning, you have to double-click on an empty space area. The next step is to move the hammer cursor to the position where you want to place the dimension line. Click on the side of the vertical walls. Two reference points will appear on each wall. Double-click on an empty space and move the hammer cursor to the position where you want to place the dimension line. Automatic dimensioning is a very powerful tool that allows you to apply the most typical dimensions on the floor plan views with only a few clicks. First, let's select all the walls. Activate the wall tool in the toolbox. Choose the Edit, Select All Walls command. Click on Document, Document Extras, Automatic Dimensioning, Exterior Dimensioning command. Define the appropriate preferences for the dimensioning. Click OK to proceed. Define the direction of the dimension lines. You can do this in one of two ways. Click the side edge of an existing wall. In this case, the dimension direction will follow the wall direction. Or, click in an empty area, and then click a second time to define the dimension direction. Click with the hammer cursor to place the dimension lines. Delete the unnecessary dimension lines. You may also insert additional dimension points. Select the dimension line with the arrow tool. Then, having the dimension tool selected, control click on Windows or command click on Mac on the desired new reference point. The new dimension point can be located between existing chain points or anywhere outside the dimension chain. Let's create new dimensions to the slab and the stair. The final result should be similar as it's presented on the screen. Creating new section markers and section views is easy with ARCHICAD's Section Tool. Activate the Section Tool in the Toolbox. Set the horizontal range to infinite depth and choose the single geometry method from the info box. Enter S2 as ID. Click twice to define both ends of the section line. Click on the right side of the line with the eyeball cursor to set the orientation of the section. Open the new section from the navigator palette. The new section viewpoint is created and listed automatically in the Navigator project map 